at hitting him in the face with my cast until he was bleeding. Um, and I didn't get in any trouble for it. But what sort of haunts me to this day is that I'm not really sure that the guy I beat up with my cast was the same person who threw me off. The, my opponent had no idea that I had broken my arm. He was like, why is this guy lying on the ground? But I'm just sort of like lying on the ground and my my arm is in, you know, multiple. And there's like another bend in it that is not there normally. Um, and I'm just lying on the ground laughing because I, I guess I'm in shock or something. I'm just la I can't stop laughing, and eventually the people around me figure out that my arm is broken, and an ambulance comes, and they offer to give me morphine or something, and I say no, because I'm just so, I'm happy. I'm so happy for some reason, like the adrenaline, everything feels great, nothing's wrong. So anyway, this was like one of the best days of my life because the because I was like silly off the drugs and adrenaline and like attention from my parents. My dad came to the hospital. And I chose to get a red cast again just to like commemorate the time that I had first broken my arm. Oh, and then I ended up using that cast to ask a girl to prom. Like I, I like I was in a sling, and then I wrote, "Will you go to prom with me?" on the on the cast. So I didn't let anyone sign it, obviously. So I could so I could say this idea, and then I like so I think I asked her to like help me with my sling or something. So she opened it, and then she saw that. A little bit unorthodox, but it worked. Terrible prom date, but she said yes. She definitely hates me. attention of one of the kids who I assumed was just gonna like make fun of me or something and I asked them if I could join I asked him if I could play with them and surprisingly enough he just 
he did speak English. He was like, yeah, come on. Like, and then they became my best friends. Um, and I came back to the house, like, you know, ecstatic, proud. So, uh, yeah, I guess sometimes when your back is against the wall, you just, you figure something out. <laughs>